what's going on guys, it's Game Over HD back at it again, and welcome back to some more Subnautica. Now hold on, why do I have a base already and a nice big old submarine? Because I recorded a video twice already and it screwed up both times. So, I take it out. But anyway, we actually have a lot of stuff that we need to do over the next few videos, including base building, uh, what looks like to be a lot of dumb stuff going on. But, not only that, I will be starting to do lockers, like a lot of big name YouTubers do. So, these are the rules, you'll see them throughout the series as I live on this base. And, these people right here have already won lockers, so I'm not going to mention why. So if you guys want to be inserted in that, go ahead and pause the video back at that 5 seconds ago. And we're going to get at it. So, it is now turning night time. So, we are going to go ahead and take, don't blow up over here, because I made a submarine, it's down there, it kind of blew up. Uh, we had some technical difficulties getting it out of the water. So, yeah. But yeah, I, I made all this stuff happen, of like, in a video that didn't really want to work. So it kind of ticked me off. Welcome aboard, Captain. All so you know what, I'm kind of low on fluids here. Ooh, that might be a problem. Okay. So even though I'm low on fluids, I might actually need to get some water from my base. Because I made um, a farm kind of area there. So I might as well use that. And also, I made another sea moth, which didn't really work out either. So, this base though, I I'm really proud of how it looks so far. It's going to look way cooler and better. Because uh, I'm probably going to make it touch all the way down into the, the deep depths below me. So I'm actually looking forward to this. It's going to be really cool. I like this idea already. Just having it kind of go into land and then into the ocean. Looks sick. Alright, well let's see what this is all about. This is Avery Quinn of Trading Ship Sunbeam. Aurora, do you read? Over. Still nothing. These old Terra ships. They run out of engine grease. They send an SOS. To offer to help. They don't pick up. Aurora, I'm out on the far side of the system. It's going to take more than a week to reach your position. Do you still need our assistance? Over. I'll try them again tomorrow. See what the long-range scan picks up in the meantime? Damn, Charter's going to have us wasting our profit margin running errands for Altera. That guy does not seem happy. What should I do about that, though? So does that mean someone's coming to rescue me? Please, Why someone just saved my life. I really hate this place. And someone told me that I can use the purple artifact to go inside the alien research facilities around the map. Now, if someone told me that there's a mountain island that's in the distance, it's over by the other side of this one. So it's basically in the same direction, but going the other way. If that makes sense. So we're going to head there. Um, and we might be able to get some cool resources. Now, hold on. When we go there, we have to watch our skin because there are fucking reapers. Uh. Alright, give me a second. We're gonna need to stop off over here at the Wiggled Wong. Because otherwise I'm probably not gonna make it very far. So I'm gonna stop right here and I'm gonna get out and get into my Seamoth. It's fully charged, but I know, Shifty, shut the up. All systems online. All right, so my Seamoth, and uh, we're gonna take this over to the Wiggled Wong. No, not the Wiggled Wong. Harry Potter. Okay, I always forget that. So we need to get we need to get some of the uh, things that we have in here. We're gonna store them inside the ship. Okay. So like we got flare. Okay, what? There he's life pod three. Let's go check it out. What?
Hey. All right, PDA. What's that? Compass. Don't I already take a half a compass? New blueprint acquired. Interesting. All right. Now that we have that, that's interesting. Okay. So now we got to be careful. Because now we're going to be in the direction of the mountains. Now there are freaking reapers. Which I heard they're little dicks. What's up, bro? No! There it is. I'm ready for silent running. Rig for silent running. Na 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 na. Detecting massive energy signature in the region. Cannot identify. No. No. What are you looking at? <laughs> Are you running? I mean, I know you like pee pee, man. But you can't have mine. Alright, goodbye. Oh, I need to eat. And put that on. What? Vital signs stabilizing. There it is. That's what I was talking about. Alright, so we're gonna go inside this big thing and try not to die. There we are, there's another one. And another one. Okay. This one's broken. Wait, oh, this is a fragment. Is the carbon based device is lighter than it looks and features a symbol? Uh huh. That's interesting. Force field control. Ooh. Let's do it. That's right. And we go. Indicate this structure is composed of a metal alloy with unprecedented integrity. This is so cool. No I'm lagging though. Bad. Structural analysis. This is interesting. Oh man, I like this. Of course, we're not safe yet. We're never gonna be safe. Alright, what's this? Data terminal. Download data. Unknown language. Attempting translation. Discovered inside an alien alien facility, it was not possible to translate any useful information. However, scans have returned some information on the device itself. Huh. What are those? Ooh. This is cool. I I am cube. What am I gonna do with that? Ooh, that looks so cool. It looks like Minecraft. OMG ripoff. Analysis of the patterns on the walls cannot ascertain whether their purpose is aesthetic or functional. Hmm. The data required.
Slow key at the night show.